Alex Ferrer, host of the nationally syndicated show Judge Alex and retired Florida Circuit Court Judge. Judge, good to see you tonight. And so this guy's now going to get tried for murder in California for the death of somebody who was a friend of his who died back in 2000. They could never tie him to the murder, but now they believe, thanks to this docudrama on HBO, they've got him. He sounds like he confessed. The handwriting that, that the murderer wrote and sent in a, in a note to police appears to match Durst's handwriting exactly. And now they're looking at him. I mean, it already appears he may be a serial killer because his wife died, then his friend dies, his neighbor he admits he, he killed. Now looking at him for two disappearances in connection with young girls? Yeah, I, I'm not sure I would label him a serial killer. First of all, we have to realize that he hasn't been convicted of any murder. In fact, he got acquitted of the murder involving... Well, they killed that man. His, ...his neighbor. Yeah, not only killed, he dismembered him, which is not, not usually... That doesn't usually lead to a self-defense no. acquittal, but... You know, there it did. Um, but, you know, usually serial killers are motivated by some type of sexual gratification, but certainly he you could You kill three people, certainly... I think you can say serial killer. Well, yeah, I, I mean, at that point we're splitting hairs. He's serially now, killing that, people. That, yeah, I think that <laughs> these suck. two ladies, what they're doing is, um, you know, he's the hot topic of the moment. So the investigators all over the country are looking, where did he live? When did he live there? Do we have any missing people? He was suspected in those cases back then. He was looked at as a person of interest, and they're reopening those. That's, I don't find that unusual. Maybe he had something to do with it. Maybe we'll find out he had nothing to do with mm -hmm. it. But at this point, anything that they can look at to try to see if he had anything to do with it. Tomorrow, if I opened the paper and I saw that he was being looked at in the Jimmy Hoffa disappearance, mm -hmm. it wouldn't shock me. The thing is, that's that's what, we, they do what, what we've learned about Durst so far is that he, he allegedly kills people he knows. So as my friend Melissa well, Francis says, do not get to know him. Like if you see him on the street, you should run in the opposite direction. Yeah, I mean, I mean, if if we if we follow through and say he that we believe he killed this friend in California, this friend was about to meet with the DA with with Janine Perot right. to talk about the disappearance of his wife. So you know that's that's a two and two you makes know, four. with a motive. Let me ask you this: um, so, the stuff that he was caught with in his hotel room—that's all new information. The latex mask. Yes. All the cash, the gun. Right. I mean, obviously, he was attempting, he was the getting ready to flee. The, yes. I, I think it's clear indication that he was getting ready to flee. He also, they Does also that found come into from court? what I read. Oh, it definitely should come into court because it's, it's evidence of consciousness of guilt. You know, when he's being investigated, he knows he's being investigated. He's just given this interview on television where he mumbles those incriminating words like, oh no, I'm caught. And then all of a sudden, he's withdrawing $9,000 a day. He gets about 350000 out. They catch him with forty five of it. Um, yeah, I think it's totally relevant. What I, I don't understand is why the latex mask. The guy's a cross-dresser. It's kind of like he's got a built-in disguise already. But, but he whatever. already I don't, I don't confessed to that. Is. Like, he confessed to doing that in, in connection with the other murder, uh, the, the, you know, to the filmmakers. So the jig was up. We knew what he looked like with a woman, you know, as a woman, right? So now he had to find something new. Some weird latex mask that they said matched his features, like... Something you'd see in like Minority Report or what, in one of those movies where they make themselves look totally different. Yeah, that, that won't make them stand out. I, I, I'm dying to see this latex mask because I can't really picture it. But you know, then again, so yeah, it does indicate does indicate to me consciousness of guilt, and I think yes. it's something that definitely comes in. Insanity the coming in. in what do you think? Do you, are they they appear to be getting ready for an insanity defense? They're already talking about his brain surgery and how he's he's mentally losing it. No, I don't. Uh, first of all. This would absolutely kill his claim of insanity when he's preparing to flee. I mean, that, that is one of the most, you know, open indicators of knowledge difference of the difference between right and wrong is, hey, I did something wrong. I better get out of Dodge. Mm -hmm. I don't think his lawyers are dumb enough to claim insanity in this case. They're pretty bright lawyers. Uh, let's be glad that he doesn't appear to be uh, likely to get out on bail anyway. Bail has been denied, and for good reason. No. Judge, good to see you. Yeah. You too, Egan. Thank you.